my Roadster I got about three years ago. It's a fantastic car. It blows away anything else on the road pretty much. And no gas. I can drive right by the gas stations. Uh, I've got a Roadster. I've had it for the last three years. And I power it off the uh, solar on the roof of my house. So the solar makes all the electricity for my house and the car. I was already sold on electric drive. The thing I like about it are all these little gadgets. You know, I, of course I'm free of oil and I love that and I'm happy. I had the original Honda EV. I've been a solar proponent and I just put 43 collectors on my roof and I'm going all solar with everything. So I was just waiting for technology and the engineering to catch up with EVs again. And it's here and I'm ready to go. I own two Leafs. Me and my wife both live within five miles of our work, and so it's a perfect car for us. I like the feel of it. It's pretty it's spacious in the back. I, I have three kids, so that's something I'm looking for. It's something that I can save gas. We have a charging station at work already, so love the electric car. Uh, we love it. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, like it a lot. Good car, I like it. What do you yes. like the most about it? The handling and the responsiveness, the immediate response. Step on the gas, takes off. Oh, this is awesome. Uh, I know that at the beginning it's going to be the price will be higher, but then at the end you're going to save a lot in the long run, so it's pretty cool. I like it, it feels nice. Right now I'm driving a Ford Mustang. I have to spend about $40 a week just on gas, and I don't even fill it up. I love driving electric. I just like the torque and the way it drives and everything. I drive a lot of mileage, so I do convert to gas a lot, and, and it's just, you don't even realize you've converted. So it's just a great car, great piece of technology. I'm gonna drive my electric car into the future. Wow, this thing lights up, doesn't it? Yeah. The whole idea with a plug-in electric car is you plug it in at home and use your home's cheap electricity to run your car. Yeah. such a great car. This is like I saw it and I was like, wow. That's funny because I'm barely doing anything. Yes. I drive 98% of the time on the battery. It is fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so the Volt's an electric car. It always uh -huh. runs on elect electricity. Goes. You can go 40 miles on the battery. The battery is actually down the middle and across behind your back. Wow. Yeah, this car is so nice. Yeah, I like it better than the other one. I find a lot of people discover new things about the car after they own it and just how much you don't buy gas or don't use gas. This is a really amazing car. How convenient it is just to plug it in at home, keep it topped off, and then every time you get in the car, it's the battery's full. It just, oh, yeah. You just get more power. <laughs> yeah, I feel like and it. And then if you, oh, my. if you put it in low, it's not really a low gear. It just regens more aggressively. Okay. And it recharges. It, so it's more of one pedal drive. Yeah, I feel it when you take the foot off the yeah. bike. Yeah, that's all. Oh, that's the power, and that's pretty cool. <laughs> I was pretty much sold before, but uh, that, that kind of took it over the edge. Yeah, we should get this car. Whoa! Turn it off. Yep. All right. I love the yep. noise. That was great. It's pretty awesome. I, it's the first time I've ever seen an electric VW, yeah. This is the Model S. That's right. Oh, nice. I love it. And I want to get one. I love that it's made right here, you know, so in California. So really want to get one. So we're about awesome. to find out. We're not in eco mode. We're in the good badass mode. So we're okay. have fun. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Peel out. There are actually many electric cars here today who drove here on sunshine. Yeah. part of this event today and as was said to be uh, only one of two members of Congress so far that drive a fully electric vehicle. This is my Nissan Leaf. I've had it for a year. I was just telling a reporter from the Daily Breeze, I haven't been to a gas station in one year. I believe a real shift is underway, a change that will not only help clean up the skies over Los Angeles but really begin to roll back the threat of global warming. I honestly believe that for too long, our dependence on gasoline has kept us entangled in some of the most unstable parts of the world. And more than once, our total reliance on oil has cost us our principles. To find out how you can benefit from plug-in electric cars and trucks, go to pluginamerica.org.